making their schoolyard a bit greener. That's what pupils at the Bettina von Arnim School have been doing as part of a work group, just one of many projects focusing on sustainability that are now available at German schools and colleges. The pupils continue to put time and energy into their creations, even once the project is over. That doesn't belong here either. 20 years ago, the term sustainability gained new currency thanks to the UN Conference on Environment and Development in Rio de Janeiro. This year, the conference Rio Plus 20 is taking place. Sustainability in education is an issue that has lower priority than others. Professor Dr. Gerhard Tehan of Berlin's Free University outlines what's been happening in educational institutions. There's a lot going on in schools, a bit in universities, and also a little in primary education. There's also been activity in the non-formal area too, that is non-school institutions and further education institutes, as well as in environmental centers. At the moment, there are about 300 courses in Germany focusing on the issue of sustainability. The course Sustainability and Quality Management at the Berlin School of Economics and Law is one of them. Sustainable business practices for companies and organizations. That's what students of Professor Dr. Anja Grotter are studying. It's about authenticity and learning how I can try to change things, but also initiate change within myself, and how, in the long term, that can lead to sustainable business and trade. The successful training project Sustainable Book Box allows children and trainees to get experience in the field. The book box is a restored telephone box which is to be used as a street library. Pupils at the Center for Color Technology and Spatial Design have been working on one of the book boxes. Department head Frank A. Dreyer explains what makes the project special. It's about working with certified wood, about the water paint, which we worked with, of course, that's vital, and the books, which aren't just thrown away, but are put in the box. It's about the opposite of what our throwaway society normally does. The transformed former telephone box really is something to look at. It's even equipped with solar power to provide light at night. The pupils are reassured by the reactions of passers-by. Suddenly everyone wanted to go in. They just wanted to grab a book and take it home. And the children loved it as well. Sustainability. A broad term in terms of education too. True, steps have been made in the right direction, but we haven't reached the finish line yet. The next goal is to go from individual projects to a situation where sustainability is fully integrated into school and college courses.